Amplify your passion for the guitar for a few dollars per month. Head over to theguitarchannel.biz. Good morning, everybody. I am very happy to welcome you another interview on The Guitar Channel. I am with the legendary Groover Jackson. Groover, how are you doing? I'm very good, thank yeah. you. Mm -hmm. Uh, I think it was like uh, last year or something like that, we did an audio interview and here we are in uh, sunny uh, Los Angeles. Uh, I am here in your like uh, secret uh, sorcerer uh, place, <laughs> right? Where the magic uh, happens, right? Yeah, the yeah. grotto. Yeah, the, the, grotto. the grotto. The grotto. <laughs> This is Grover Jackson, the grotto. I can say I have visited the grotto, uh, <laughs> the Grover, uh, the grotto. <laughs> the, the secret, uh, the secret uh, space, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's good to be here because it is way more quieter than the NAM, right? Oh, I NAM mean. was very loud, <laughs> yes. So this is much more relaxing, mm -hmm. yeah. It is my very first uh, NAM show, so you have to tell me uh, what is your best memory and worst memory of past edition. I guess you, you've done many. Uh, I've been going to NAM for 43 years. Okay. <laughs> this, this is my 43rd NAM, so it's a long, long time. Yeah. NAM, when I first started going in the early 70s, mm -hmm. um, was in the Disneyland Hotel, in the lobby of the Disneyland Hotel, and you could walk the whole show in 10 minutes. Okay. <laughs> so now it's, you know, 50, 60, 70,000 people and a couple of hundred thousand square feet of show. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it's changed a lot over the years. Um, Probably the 80s were the era, you know, in the Jackson Charvel era. I mean, it, we, we would have small booths and have four, five, six hundred people lined up to get in the booth. Okay. So those were the go go heydays mm -hmm. of Los Angeles metal, mm -hmm. the Los Angeles metal community yeah. and, and that period. So mm -hmm. those were great days. They were even more exhausting than today mm -hmm. because of the amount of interaction that went on. But it was exciting and it was a great time. Mm -hmm. It was a great time for music. Yeah. And if you have to pick uh, one uh, uh, hour of stories which happened to you during the... Oh, we, we did a NAMM show in Chicago. In the old days, the big show was in the summer in Chicago because that's where NAMM ah, okay. was based at that time. Mm -hmm. And we, we finished a show quite successfully and had about 10 or 12 guitars to take out. And there was, I think, four, five of us. We had our cases hidden in the booth, so we didn't have to wait for anybody to bring us cases. And uh, we were going to take all the guitars were all sold, but they had to be brought back to Los Angeles to be cleaned up before we could ship them to the, mm -hmm. the customers. And um, Chicago is a big union town. Um, we put our guitars in our cases and picked them up and started to leave. And uh, a fellow came up and said, you can't carry those out of here. Okay. And we said, well, Why would that be? Since I own them, I made them. Well, it's a Teamster town, and you you can't you cannot carry those out of here. Amplify your passion for the guitar for a few dollars per month. Head over to theguitarchannel.biz.